Well, Charlie, what's the mood in the dressing room there? Because uh, I think that's a game you might well have won. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a positive that we've, we've come off of one point, but at the same time, we're disappointed to, to not take all three, um, which is obviously a testament to the lads. Um, the past four games have been a lot better. We took eight points from 12, um, and yeah, it's something to build on. The boss was saying there, you know, that, that the plan really worked really well because yourself and Harvey were causing all sorts of problems on the break, and that's how your goal came. Yeah, um, obviously we, we knew they'd, they'd have long periods of the ball, and when we turned it over, it was important that we got into their half and you know took the chances that we got. Um, and you know we, we did create chances. Obviously, the keepers made a good save, uh, a double save actually for Harvey. Um, but yeah, as I say, we're disappointed not to take all three points. And you've had to be a little bit patient the last few games, you know, you come in tonight and you score a goal, you, you're taking your chance. Yeah, it's, uh, we, we, we've obviously got a good good squad. Um, Christian, obviously Luke, who's, uh, who's been unfortunate with his, with his injuries, but yeah, obviously when you're called upon, you've, you've, you've got to play your part and, and take your chance because you don't know when the next time your chance will come. Yeah, I mean, I mean different weapons you've got, aren't you? If you look at the strike force you've got at the moment, you know, different types of players. And as you say with yourself and Harvey tonight, you know, you can worry big lads like Aidan Flint at the back of their mid-face. Yeah, everyone's got different attributes and obviously me and Harvey, you know, we, we probably like to run them behind a lot more. And you know, with big centre half, you probably don't want to chase yourself. So, yeah, that worked in that sense. Um, obviously in the air, they're very good, but you know, we kept the ball on the floor as much as we could and, and, and ran around the side of them, which, which is what we, we aim to do. Of course, another young lad that's uh, scoring goals for fun at the moment, Robbie Apter. You know, you, you see yeah. him in training, another one tonight for him. He's on fire, isn't he? Yeah, Robbie's been very good since he's come in, obviously. Um, you know, he, did, he didn't play at the start. But as you say, you, you've got to take your chance when it comes and Robbie's definitely done that. And it isn't just about the, you know, the attacking force as well, it's, it's how well you're working as a team, you know, working so hard to close down from the front. I mean, that, that's where it starts defending, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it, it's, it's high intensity. Um, you know, as, as you say, without the ball, it's, 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 it's demanding. Um, but, you know, you, you've got to stick to a game plan. And, you know, if you don't see the ball, you've got to run and try and get the ball back. And, and that's what we did tonight. Yeah. Is that one of the things, really, that the boss has been sort of drilling into you all the time about that, how important that is? Yeah, well, I mean, if you... If, you know, me and Harvey were the first line of defence tonight and the higher we win the ball back, the less running we've got to do back towards our own goal. So, yeah, that, that was the plan and uh, it worked. And you say last four games, you know, a lot of confidence there in the squad now. You just seem as if you've got a balance about the side now and, and a real togetherness and particularly with the fans as well at the moment. Yeah, I mean, the fans have backed us through the, through the worst times this season, which is obviously hard to do as a fan. You, you pay your money to come watch the game and, you know, if your team doesn't win, you've got, you're entitled to your opinion. But... You know, we've got to change somehow in the last four games. We've made the step towards that. Um, look at that. Um, <laughs> another fan. Yeah, another fan. Yeah, Harvey, yeah. My friend over there. Yeah, I, I suppose just at the end, you know, two yellows for Jordan and all looks a little bit harsh to us, certainly, watching from the, from the sidelines. Yeah, Jordan was excellent tonight, as he has been for the last few. Um, you know, it's, it's probably unfortunate on another day we might get away with it, but, you know, the referees decided to do that and we can't affect the referee's decision, so we'll obviously be with Alton for a few games now, but again, we've got we've got Joe Yarn, we've got John who come on tonight, um, we've got other lads who can fill in, um, so yeah, every confidence in them. I know you're freezing cold, but you must be full of confidence now as a squad. You know, you look as if you can move up that table now. Yeah, I am freezing cold, as you said. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, we are full of confidence. You know, we've got to take every game as it comes, and the Christmas period is always busy. Injuries, injuries happen, games get called off, so... You know, we're just looking forward to the next game.